Hey guys, so I'm making this questions and answers video. Um, for those of you who asked me questions, I'm gonna go ahead and answer them. Um, I got a question, a couple questions off Facebook and Twitter for those of you who have added me on those websites. Um, but I mostly took them from Instagram because that's where I'm most active. So my first one, I'm gonna jump, go ahead and jump right into it because I hate making long videos. Um, advice for you? Do I have any advice for young moms? I don't. Um, just because I myself am not a young mom yet. Um, I'm only a mommy to be. Um, the only th but I do have advice for, um, for you know, pregnant teens. Just be graceful and be the bigger person in every situation. And prepare yourself to be that parent that you're going to need to be. The ideal parent that you want to be. Um, and make sure that you're not doing anything to put your baby in harm. Sorry, Ava's playing with me. Um, but yeah, you just... Sorry, it almost fell. Stop it. Stop it. Just think, you know, people will recognize when you're doing a good thing and being the bigger person and putting yourself on a, on a path to be a really good parent to your child. So just, you know, make sure that you're doing that. And, of course, take care of yourself because taking care of yourself is taking care of that baby. Ava, stop. Stop it. Stop. Sorry, guys. Ava? Ava. So It's like raising a child already. Shut your breath. Okay, next one. Um, do I ever see me and Robbie getting married? And um, people want to know if we ever talk about parenting styles and if we agree on them. <clears throat> yes, Robbie and I plan to get married. Um, you know, I'm 17, or I'm 16, he's 17. Um, we talk about it a lot, and that's our plan, <clears throat> you know. Um, so that's kind of really all I have to say about that. Um, but yes, we have talked about parenting styles, and we like agree on almost everything, 99% of everything, so I think when it's going to come time to, you know, um, when we actually have to raise her and make decisions or give her punishments when she's a little mad, you know, when she's been bad, um, where it's going to be really easy for us, oh, stop, and, um, we're going to be able to do that just fine, because we, oh, sorry guys, because we see eye to eye on almost everything, um, cravings, do I have any? My whole pregnancy, it's just been, you know, give me food, and I'm a happy girl. Just give me any kind of food. But lately, it's been um, chocolate frosties from my work. I work at Wendy's, for those of you who don't know. And um, it's also been lemon slices. <coughs> Some of you might think that's gross, but we have, like, this container at work full of lemon slices. And, like, I'll go up to the front and fill up a cup, and I'll go in the back room and just eat them. And I think it's so yummy, and it makes me so happy. So, people are like, you're going to ruin your teeth. And I'm like, well, I'm pregnant and I'm be grouchy if I don't eat these. Ugh. Stop it. So, yeah. That's one craving that I've had. Top names. Okay, here we go. Um, well, another question is, did I want a boy or a girl? At first, I wanted a boy, but as soon as I started looking at baby girl stuff, I was set on ha- Stop. No, you don't have the video. I was set on having <laughs> a little um, girl. Look at her. You're such a brat. Don't bite me. Um... So I'm having it. You're making this impossible. Sorry, guys. It's like raising a child already. I was set on having a little girl. Um, as soon as I started looking at girl stuff, um, but for boys, Robbie really liked the name Ian, and I was not having it. I did not like it at all. Um, I really liked Wyatt and Grayson. I thought they were very classy, and I thought they were handsome names. And I would have really pushed for uh, Grayson or Wyatt because I love those names. Um, uh, for girls, my top pick was always Lillian. I think it's so beautiful, so I could call her Lily. And um, if I ever have another daughter, her name will be Lillian. Um, but Zoe's, uh, Zoe was always Robbie's first pick. And, you know, I could just tell there was something about this name. Like, he was just drawn to his name, and that's what he wanted his daughter's name to be. And I thought it was adorable, too, so I was like, okay. And um, her middle names were not announcing till you know, besides the family and stuff, till the day she's born. So you guys are going to have to wait for that. <clears throat> The worst part about going to the OBGYN and being pregnant. Okay, so the worst part about being pregnant is your body is always changing before you have a chance to get used to the changes. Um, and your boobs always hurt. And for any girl, you know, that's a pain in the ass. Uh, before you start your period and stuff, you know, for those of you who boobs hurt, it's it's a pain in the ass. And it's like that. It's been like that for like nine months for me. So just imagine that. It sucks. Um, the worst part of going, back, uh, going to the OBGYN, it's not really that bad. Um... Besides peeing in a cup every time, I know it's not a big task and they're not asking a lot of you. I just feel like it's weird, like, people are going to, you don't have to touch my pee or, like, a cup that has my pee in it. Like, I wouldn't want to touch a cup that had someone's pee in it. Like, ew. 
So, um, <laughs> I just think it's gross and I think it's weird. Um, but that's the only part, you know, it's not that I hate it. That's just the weirdest part for me going to the OBGYN. And did I want kids and do I ever want more? Yes, I wanted kids. Um, you know, my mom does daycare and so sometimes her daycare kids drive me crazy. I'd be like, I'm never having kids, you know, because they would just drive me so crazy. They still do. <laughs> um, but I did want kids and I do plan to have one or two more. Um, I'm not crazy about having a bunch of bunch of kids. Um, but yeah, I do plan on having more kids. Not until later in the future. In a little bit. Uh, so yeah. That's all the questions that I really wanted to answer. I hope you guys like them. Sorry that I'm so lazy today and I'm laying down and um, my cat was like all up in the video. I apologize. Um, yeah, I hope you guys liked the questions. Um, the, you know, the oh, one question I did want to answer is people ask me is why we decided to spell Zoe the way we did. Robbie sent me a bunch of spellings. Um, and one I vetoed right away was Z-O-O-E-Y. I think that sounds like Zooey, and I could not do it. Uh, I wasn't gonna. Uh, I tried to push for Z-O-E-I-I, and he was like, um, no. And I was like, okay, you're a brat. But we finally came to the conclusion that Z-O-E-Y was really cute, and we like it, and they were sticking with it, and that's our name. And, um, so yeah, I hope you guys really like this video. Um, I am, I have, uh, um, ideas for other videos, it's just whenever I get the time to do them, I do them. Um, <laughs> sorry guys about her, but yeah, that's about it, that's all I really have to say. Um, I'll keep you guys updated on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter for those of you who follow me on those sites. So yeah, I really hope that you guys enjoy these videos, you can subscribe if you want, and give me ideas if there's something that you really want to see. If you guys have any other questions, just leave them, and I might do a third video, or I might just answer your question directly, so just let me know. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!